Welcome to the Potter Blog site. It is Sunday, March 11th, one year since Fukushima, uh, 1.42 p.m. It started raining here about half an hour ago. Uh, if you'll notice, I'm not wearing gloves. Uh, the reason I'm not wearing gloves is I took a sample while we were driving home from church and I detected little to no radioactivity in the swipe I took off of the windshield. So, do now here. Take a bigger swipe off the hood of the truck. Let's see what we come up with. And look at that. It's, you can hear some in there. These are some of the lowest readings we've had in a long time. Two times background. And it's already been raining roughly half an hour. This is the initial part of the storm. And usually the leading edge of the storm has the lowest amount of uh, radioactivity in it. So now we're a little bit over three times background, almost four times background. It takes uh, roughly, it's a 30 second moving average, so it takes at least 30 seconds for it to pop up to its highest level. Still, this is a uh, very low reading since uh, I believe in August, when the last uh, major earthquake hit over there and really shook things up. So, hopefully this was a, a short respite from the fallout. Uh, we'll take another reading at the trailing edge of the storm. But uh, Once again, let's hope this is good news. and We'll have to check the position of the jet stream, because uh, it could be the jet stream is not overhead, and that's why these readings are so low.